in this reading, we are going to pull cards on you and your current situation, the person on your mind, person or situation on your mind, where they are, how they feel about the situation, how they view it, and their feelings and thoughts towards you and next action. So I just want to show you a free shuffle real quick. It looks like you, I think you, maybe they, somebody's walking away from something um, that they put a lot into. See what that six of pentacles, this is just pre-shuffle. So we're just, I'm just sharing the pre-shuffle. Um, but then we have, it's kind of like this two of pentacles. It's, it, there's a feeling of not wanting it to be over. It looks like something is over with that 10 of swords, but there was so much put into it or so much energy in it that it's hard to really not, you know, you kind of go back and forth with not being settled about it and then you've got the ace of wands that could indicate a new passionate beginning so we'll just have to see there's an element of not letting go let's see what's going on with this person though so how are you hey if you haven't yet i have um it's come to my attention that only like 20 percent of my regular viewers have um, are subscribed so if you would will you please take a moment to hit subscribe. It means so much to me. It helps the channel more than you know. It helps keep the channel surviving on the live. Um, <clears throat> okay. Page of Pentacles. Hmm. Wondering if that's an apology. I don't like that that's not focused because these are such pretty cards. Okay, so Page of Pentacles. So this is the person's situation on your mind. Could be somebody, you know, somewhat young. Pages are thought of as young. Oh, goodness. Somebody, the Seven of Wands is... <clears throat> yes, somebody that's not moving forward, but they're just kind of holding their ground. It could be a stubborn energy. But this is also kind of feeling like an apology. Maybe they want an apology from you. And then the Devil card... Okay, so definitely an element of not letting go on both sides. How they view you and the situation. Nine of Wands. See, they they feel injured. You may both be feeling injured. Burned. Oh, Two of Cups. So this person isn't acting like it, but it looks like they want to have an equal give and take. There may be an element of um, drinking or, you know, self-medicating, I'm wondering. But we're going to dive in. That was just a thought. Hmm. Next actions toward you. Okay, five of pentacles. King of pentacles. Hey, man, I feel like this person is all over the place. You know, they want you to see them as secure and stable, but they're not acting it. That's so interesting. And then look, six of cups, bottom of the deck. So you're not expecting, you will hear from this person, but it's gonna be completely unexpected. Six of cups, a return, somebody coming in. I mean, I'm kind of feeling that apology, that page of pentacles. And then the moon is, you know, unexpected. I feel like maybe this person might, ah, uh, have something to drink or relax at some point and just on a whim reach out. Yeah, there's something here about um it's it's like an I don't know, it's untrustworthy. What is it? Why, is it, why do we have the page of pentacles? The person or situation in your mind, page of pentacles. <clears throat> Ace of Cups. This person may just kind of like on the fly say wonderful things. Look at that. Ace of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. I think they're just kind of back and forth. Hard to read. Um, why the Devil card? Whoa. Why the Devil card? Could be dealing with a Capricorn. Or an Aries. Gosh, I feel like this person wants you to do all the work. One more on the magician. The magician is making things happen. The cat, okay, so the devil and the Capricorn, I mean the devil. The devil, the Capricorn, 
What am I saying? The devil and the magician card together, that's like manipulation often. I don't know that it's intentional, but I just feel like this person is all over the place. They're inconsistent. Look at this emperor. So, I don't know, this person wants to be um, looked up to, respected, uh, but it doesn't feel like there's something not legitimate about it. Tell me about the Nine of Wands. Four of Pentacles. Does this person pretend to be something that they're not, maybe? Hmm. They may have, like, just recently come into some financial issues. I got something in my eye. What about the Two of Cups? Why the Two of Cups? Thoughts, feelings towards you, how they view you, and the situation. This, I think this person is a, like, um, is a, uh, somebody that fantasizes more than they actually take action. It's like they have these big, it's limerence. This person may be limerent over you, where they think about you in a light of you being happy and together, and they daydream about it. I mean, the roles could be reversed, but they, it's almost like they daydream about how great it is, but they don't really seem to take action. It's almost like a fairy, a, a make-believe world. I don't know, is this person, I'm wondering if they're not very mature. Why do we have the Three of Cups? So if you're getting really inconsistent energies from this person, there might be a, a drinking issue. You know, it might be like, well, that didn't make sense. Or maybe they forget what they say, which doesn't make sense. It could be because they may say things on the fly. I don't think I've ever had a reading like that. Um, what about the Three of Cups? Tell me more about this Three of Cups, Five of Cups. This is so interesting because this Five of Cups is like, it's a Three of Cups and it's a Two of Cups, you know? And there's the Two of Cups and there's the Three of Cups. So this person, it's almost like they want... The two of cups so badly but I, I don't know they sabotage it or it's almost like they'd rather just sit and think about it than actually make something happen why the eight of cups this is a strange reading they just avoid being the one to get dropped it's like they they'd rather just fantasize it but not take chance it's like they'd rather play the whole thing out in their head but not actually do anything about it i'm very confused by this person maybe you are too um their next actions towards you i kind of feel like they're you know like playing going to be playing the victim like is this, this person acts like you know, they were all secure and stable, but you blew it or you didn't show interest. So strange. Yeah, they. I think this person, like, plays the victim. And I don't even know that it's in per totally intentional, but um, I'm not sure they know how they're... I just think they're a pretender. My camera is going to die. This is probably going to have to be a bonus reading. Let's just get one more. Five of Wands. They don't know what to do or how to handle it, so they just hold back. They want you to make things happen. Look at that. They hold back, and they want you to take the lead while they wait. And then if you don't, they kind of act like, well, you didn't show. They, like, have themselves convinced that you're supposed to come after them. I feel like this person does manipulate. I'm not sure if they even are fully aware of it or the extent of it. Let me pull one more. Because my camera's going to die. And then we'll just make this a bonus because it was so little. Ace of Swords. But you're going to have truth come out. The truth is going to come out. It's going to be shown. Look at that. Illuminated. Um, tell me one more before the camera cuts off. One more on this Ace of Swords. Okay, so it looks like the truth will come out and then there'll be an apology. I think this is telling you to be honest with how you view things, but not in a mean way. Just in a, this is what it seems like to me. It seems like to me you're not 
showing effort or interest or, you know I feel like they're gonna do what they're gonna turn around what they are this person turns around what they do to you they kind of make it like a mind F tour they put it on on them and then I think you're just going to be honest about it and then hopefully they're gonna see it truth is gonna come to light and then it looks like an apology I keep saying one more yeah justice it might be a karmic lesson. Maybe this is something that you've struggled with in the past and now you're going to be able to see it firsthand and like, I don't know. <laughs> this person is confusing. They are coming back. They're going to reach out to you unexpectedly, uh, but I think they're going to make it out. They're going to kind of make it out like that's you. Everything that they do to you, they're going to say they feel. Okay. There could be some um, outer, you know, self-medicating or something messing things up too. Something doesn't jive. Something doesn't jive. Memory wise, you know, it feels like manipulation. Okay. I love you guys. Let's make this a bonus. We'll do another one. Okay. Love you guys. Bye, Kansas.